Different day, but same third quarter for these Blazers. They were outscored 29 to 13 in the third frame of game three, and it proved to be all the Warriors needed to take back the momentum and end up winning the game. Afterwards, the team in the locker room saying it's incredibly frustrating to see the same thing that happened in game two happen here tonight. We got to be ready for that, you know, they're ready for that attack and, and be more aggressive. You know, we, we can't let them be the aggressors when we have the lead. We have to continue to continue to work and continue to put our foot on their neck and not, not give them a chance. But we haven't been able to do that, obviously, the past couple games. It's tough. I mean, you play so well for, I mean, the first half. And I mean, they just, they, I mean, they do it over and over again, that third quarter run. And um, fortunately, unfortunately, we couldn't. We couldn't really bounce back from that, and they kind of carried that momentum into the fourth. It's tough, man, because especially we needed this game. We did a lot to uh, put ourselves in a position to win, you know what I'm saying? And, yeah, yeah, you know, um, to have two straight games of where we could possibly win and, you know, go up 2-1, you know, that's, I guess it's the most frustrating thing, but we just got to, you know, stick with it. And, you know, we got a team, you know, a locker room. Locker room full of guys that are, you know, going to keep competing and, you know, battle for each other. Now, of course, the Blazers are down 3-0 in this series. No team has ever come back from being down 3-0 and won a best of seven series. But the team says they can't think about it now. All they can think about is one game at a time, and the next one is Monday night with a six o'clock tip-off. From Moda, I'm AJ McCord for Coin Six Sports.